What is going on you guys? Welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time seeing my lovely, lovely face, warm, warm welcome to you. My name is Osho and I post new videos every single week. Now, I wanted to say something real quick. So somebody commented on my previous video about like the sound and the shakiness and all of that. So with regards to the sound, guys, I'm really just working with the equipment that I have right now. Um, currently, I'm using a phone, in case y'all didn't know. I'm using a phone, and this one requires like specific type of earphones. So even if I, you know, wanted to use earphones instead, I couldn't do that because at the moment I can't even afford those earphones right now. So. Please bear with me guys. The important thing is that you take the message away from these videos that I'm making for you guys. Let's get straight into this video. So today we are going to talk about the mindset of defeat. So what is the mindset of defeat? So the mindset of defeat is one where you have given up. So basically you just, something happened and all of a sudden you throw in the towel um, because of this thing that happened and you just give up on your goals and your dreams, right? So for example, you feel like you are too old and you feel you're convinced that because you weren't working on your dreams or you haven't achieved it, you didn't achieve it when you were younger, you're never going to achieve your goal or your dream, right? Or you feel like your past mistakes um, or your upbringing are what define you and you have this belief that because of your past or your upbringing you're never going to reach your goals um, among many other examples of a defeated mindset right having a defeated mindset is a danger because it keeps you stagnant and it keeps you from moving forward right it keeps you from fulfilling your purpose because you believe that you've already lost, right? Hence, you've given up. Whereas if you have a victorious mindset, you believe that um, you are capable of doing anything. Nothing defines you. Your past does not define you. Your age does not define you. When you have a victorious mindset, you are able to move forward. Having a victorious mindset empowers you and it strengthens you. It empowers you to move forward and do the things that need to be done. I know it's difficult to um, develop a habit in the beginning, but the important thing is that you just start, you know? And the important thing is that you are consistent because it does take time. It takes a long time to shift from one mindset to another but it is possible and the first step that you need to take is to watch how you talk about yourself because my philosophy and actually it's it's true all over like what you say about yourself is exactly who you are okay so if you tell yourself that you are nothing or you are never going to be able to do X, Y, Z, or you're never going to achieve X, Y, Z, then that is exactly what is going to happen. However, if you continuously, when you continuously tell yourself that you got this, you know, you have a positive mindset, you can do this, and if I continue, you know, working on myself and working hard, I will make it. That is exactly what is going to happen. So having a victorious mindset is very, very beneficial. You know, it's good for your mental health as well, your physical health, depending on what your goals and dreams are in life and what your priorities are. Like, it's just really important to have a positive mindset because at the end of the day, the thing that drives us human beings is purpose and when you have a defeated mindset, you take that away from you, so you lose your fire, okay? When you don't have purpose, you lose the drive, you know? And that is what keeps humans moving. 
So by developing a victorious mindset, you keep fueling your dreams, you keep fueling your, your fire, you know, and when you have, when you feel like you have a purpose in life and you need to fulfill that purpose, the sky is the limit. That is it for today's video. If you guys resonate with what I'm talking about, please leave a comment in the comment section. I would love to hear from you guys. What do you think about, you know, the mindset of defeat? And likewise, what do you think about the mindset of victory? What does it mean to have a mindset of defeat or a mindset of victory? And what are your stories with regards to today's topic? And if you haven't subscribed already, I don't know what you're waiting for. I don't understand what you're waiting for. Click the subscribe button, click on that notification bell, be notified when the next video is going to be posted, and I will see you guys 